Hi, and welcome to episode 31 of Root Beer Library, where we taste root beer sodas and snacks first so you don't have to. Today, we are tasting, dang, that's good, butterscotch root beer. Let's pop this top and get into it. All right, so today we are tasting, dang, that's good, butterscotch root beer. I'm really excited about this. And our guests today are some of my favorite Funko Pops. We have the Baywatch crew. We've got the Hoffman in Mitch Buchanan and CJ Parker, better known as Pamela Anderson. They are joining us today. Hopefully you guys will enjoy this as much as I'm sure I will. Let's go ahead and pop this thing. Oh, that smelled, smelled good. That sounded good. Smells good. Dang, that smells good. I will say it's death. Anything with the, the butterscotch or the different kind of flavors, most cases I end up with a little bit of a chemical smell. It might just be me. I did get a little of that. You know, I'm, I'm getting a little of that that fake butterscotch kind of smell to it. Again, it might just be the way my nose is picking up the, the smells and the flavors, how they're mixed in here. Let's go ahead and taste this. Dang! That ain't that great. Um, I, I'm... I'm uh, unfortunately not pleasantly surprised it's um, I have not had I've had dang sodas before I have not had the butterscotch unfortunately I'm just not impressed um, not really a lot of butterscotchy taste to it um, uh, I always hate to bring up names of other root beers or sodas when I'm, I'm reviewing this particular one, but if you go to like AJ Stevens, much more of a butterscotch flavor to it. It has that chemically smell too, but it has way more of a butterscotch flavor. This really doesn't have much of a butterscotch flavor. It doesn't have much flavor at all. I'm a little disappointed in this. Yeah, it's, it's almost more like a, a sugar water than anything else. And I've had some of their other sodas and they, they definitely have tasted better. I was really expecting more out of this. Unfortunately, I, you know what, I gotta give this a thumbs down. Dang, I'm sorry about that. But I'm, I'm giving dang butterscotch root beer a thumbs down. Uh, it's just not, not popping for me. Not much flavor going on at all. I couldn't even pair this with anything. There's just not a whole lot going on. I don't, I would not use this. I would not, could not, Sam I am. Really, I just don't see this being, uh, it's definitely not gonna be in my basket when I go shopping. So don't wanna downplay it too much. Don't wanna say anything too bad about it. It's just not, not a, not a, not a, yeah. It's not happening for me. So unfortunately, not a whole lot of flavor. I'm hoping as I'm talking to you that it would build up. I've had that happen before. Just nothing out of this one. Not much of a smell, not much of a flavor. It's almost more like sugar water than anything else. So unfortunately, this is a thumbs down for me. So there you go, episode 31 of Root Beer Library. Don't forget to like and share and smash the bell down below. You'll know whenever we post a new video and in regards to dang butterscotch root beer, if you drink this and you like it, like I even, I said this about Moxie, I'm gonna say this about this, please leave a comment down below. Let me know, say, hey Matt, you're totally off your rocker. This is the best stuff known to man. You know, I'd love to have that conversation. Also, um, if you agree with me, please comment down below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to drink responsibly and we'll see you on the next one.